Behind me is the Fitch House, and it was built in Willimantic, Connecticut around 1737. Today they have some cooking going on in the back kitchen, and I think it's worth taking a look at. We're going to make an apple pie, aren't we? That sounds like I a think, idea. ladies. Good day. We well, Good we're day. just fine, thank you. Here in, in the Fitch House, we have uh, two lovely ladies cooking the main meal today. Right. Uh -huh. Okay. We're preparing our our dinner. Of the, course, dinner would be the big meal of the day. And at that's noon served, time. served at noon. Right. Okay. Served at noon. It's called the nooning. Um, so today we're going to make an apple pie. Okay. And, and we also are soaking some fish. And my dear daughter here is going to make some fish cakes. Some fish cakes. Now, what fish cakes are? Uh, just, just like fish sticks of today. Very or? similar to really? you know, okay. mashed potatoes and fish all mashed together and fried into little cakes. And okay. basically, they're the same things that are in modern fish sticks. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. All right. So those, those were common fare in 1830. Yes, very common for breakfast or for your dinner time meal. Great. Great. Uh -huh. Now look at this right here. This is interesting. This is Those a... Those are scallop squash. Scar um, scarlet? Scallop. Uh, a scarlop. Okay. Uh, and squash. what we'll do is cut it up okay. and um, we don't even skin it. We'll just put it in boiling water and then um, put butter and salt and pepper. And just kind of saute it? Right. It, it also, sometimes we uh, cut up an onion. With and throw it, it in to there. Give it a little more flavor. Oh, that's great. And that would be a, a separate dish right. at mm -hmm. the dinner table. Mm -hmm. Now, you, dinner is at noon. Is there another meal, a, a supper later on? At on night, Tuesday? we have leftovers from okay. the noontime meal or tea and cheese and bread in the sitting parlor. Okay. Um, of course, you would want to eat your big meal at noontime because you can't see in the evening. Ah, and you don't want to uh, use up your candles to eat. Right. And then in the summertime, of course, um, the printer would be w want to be up in his print shop uh, until dark. Okay. So um, that's right. Now, the uh, Mr. Fitch was the the printer, the printer. in town. The printer uh -huh. in town. Okay. This so this is, is this is house. his home. All right. And right. so he would be um, early morning. We would be the first ones up <laughs> and get the fire going and prepare a large breakfast, yes. and then uh, clean up from that. And in after cleaning up from the uh, breakfast, we would start the big meal of the day which, of course, as I said, would be noontime, and then leftovers in the evening. Hmm, that's great. Now, a couple more things here. I see uh, right here we have just some butter, mm -hmm. some common butter, mm -hmm. and um, this right here look, almost looks like a poultice of some kind, but it's, it's what? That's some pounded cheese. It's pounded. It's cheese that we grated because it had gotten a little too old and a little too hard to just eat normally, so you grate it up, add some of the butter to it, some sherry and some different spices like cayenne and pepper, mm -hmm. and just pound it all together. And it's a nice spreadable cheese. It goes very well on, the, on these long rolls that we made. Oh, so it's a cheese butter spread that you can put on the long mm -hmm. rolls. On the long rolls. And, yes. the, and this is just a flour, a flour biscuit? Or is yes. It, okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. And I see you have some beets here. Mm. These, look, these look real good. Now, what, what's on there? There's some, looks like some spices. Well, on those, what we did was we boiled them up and then melted butter on them, put mm -hmm. some flour on them, added some vinegar, some salt and pepper, and a little bit of parsley, and made some dressed beets. Well, those look real good. Those They're very good. <laughs> looks great. This was the one other thing that I wanted to see here. This is a, it looks like an apple pie, but it's not, is it? It's very similar to, though. It's called a Marlboro pudding. It's some apples that we stewed and then added a custard sauce, and the custard had some lemon juice in it as well, and we just baked it inside of a bottom crust, and it's a very tasty thing to have. We might even have it for the evening meal, the cold leftovers. So both very of them. Good thing. Well, that's great. So everything here would be the dinner at noon, and mm -hmm. that would be it. Yes. Well, that's great. Well, common fare for the midday, and I appreciate spending some time with you. You're it's, welcome. It's Perhaps great. you could uh, sit and have dinner with us. Perhaps we will when we finish up here. So I appreciate very good. it. Thank you very much. You're welcome.